always forget to take them off in their clearing. Anyways, today is October 3rd, so this is Vlogtober Day 3. This is going to be a super short one because Jesse acted like a three-year-old today. And drove me crazy, and he was crazy, and I was crazy, and we butted heads. If you believe in Zodiac and things like that, we are both Tauruses. We were both born in early May, so we both... <laughs> We don't get along good when we're alone for long periods of times, and I'm a stay-at-home mom, and he's my only kid, so we're always together, so we constantly butt heads. That's why I tell Devin all the time, because we're two bulls butting heads just constantly. But today was just one of those days where I didn't really do anything but deal with Jesse and his dramas, and he probably thought the same thing of me. He is passed out on the couch right now, so uh, which I'm so glad. I probably shouldn't let him be napping. Because that means he's going to stay up late, but he's calmed down <laughs> for a few minutes. So I'm letting him nap for a little while, and then I'll wake him up. i got to fold some laundry. i got two uh, baskets of laundry i got to do. But I wanted to hop on here real fast because I didn't do anything today other than um, there's a couple clips of me crocheting a pink rosy wrap from Randy. I will link the pattern of that below. She has a written form of it and a, a um, video tutorial, which is the one I followed today. Um... I made it because Cindy from Cindy Hearts Crochet uh, is doing a thing where like you make one of those and take a picture of it for breast cancer awareness uh, and I thought that would be fun. And plus I like that pattern. I made a red one but I can't find it. I think it must be in my box in the closet of hats and scarves and things. It must have got stuck in there. Um, that I'll be pulling out soon anyways because it'll be getting cold. But now i got a hot pink one too. I was wearing it earlier. And Jesse, in one of his good moments today, he said, I like that thing on your head. <laughs> And I said, thanks, Bubba. But anyways, I wanted to hop on here real fast just so you guys could see me at least right now. I uh, made the rosy wrap today. I did finish... Oh, that's my neighbors. I thought that was Jesse. I did finish a, another one of my patterns that I had to take pictures for for the PDF. And uh, I will be sharing that one. I'm hoping Saturday is when I'm going to release that because it's a Halloween pattern and I want to try to get it out, you know, before Halloween. And then I got two other patterns that I was working on today that are Christmas ones and they'll be released after I get it back from a couple of testers I sent it to. Um, my idea is to get it out early because people who are making for craft fairs or for family gifts they might want to get a jump start. Anyways, yesterday, was it yesterday? Or was it this morning? Yesterday. Last night I made two more turtles. <laughs> These are scraps. Um, I think this bottom color is cafe latte and this is a tweed. It was gifted to me by somebody just a, a scrap ball of it it's I think it's red heart it feels like red heart tweed um but I don't know what the color is but I just love that turtle pattern and I made it while watching some more videos last night and I'll probably end up making more of these just because they're fun oh and I did make another little pumpkin today because I had to make one to take pictures for that pumpkin pattern uh and I made it smaller because I was lazy but the pictures are the same um for how to make it with the uh lobes or ridges or whatever um so i got a little tiny pumpkin i just got to make a stem to put on it and then i'm just gonna throw it with these little turtles for my craft fair <laughs> i don't know how much to charge for these little turtles like a couple dollars maybe um i don't know if people buy them uh amber gifted me some hooky things maybe i could make some keychains out of some of these turtles i might do that i'll go i might do that tomorrow but anyways i'm gonna hop off here because i gotta go do these two loads of laundry and i haven't i haven't even done anything for dinner yet and it's it's almost seven <laughs> That's why I shouldn't be letting him sleep, but I need a break from him. So tonight's probably going to be a nuke night, which means we're going to eat stuff that's nukeable, which is in the microwave. <laughs> but uh, that's okay, because you can't cook homemade meals every day, especially when you have a crazy three-year-old. But yeah, tomorrow is Friday. I don't think I have to do anything tomorrow. I do have to go to the post office in the morning because I'm getting two, pa uh, two packages, almost said patterns from Arizona. I don't know what it is. I don't know if I ordered something or Devin did that came from Arizona or if it's something from somebody who watches me or what. I don't know. I'll have to see tomorrow. And I should also get my knit crate tomorrow. And I'm not sure if it's September's or October's. I can't remember if I got September's. I remember the beginning of September was when those hurricanes was supposed to be hitting and um, they sent out an email about how they may be late. And I can't remember if I got September's. The last one I got was a purple um purpley one with like I think some pink in it but I can't remember what month that was for so I'm getting a knit crate tomorrow too and uh I will share that with you guys 
share that with you guys. And right now I'm going to do laundry and find something easy to eat. <laughs> Bye guys.